Now, many materials have physical properties that will change as you heat them up or cool them down. In other words, the physical properties will change with temperature. And these properties can be used to measure temperature. Now, what is temperature? Temperature tells us how much kinetic or thermal energy the particles of the material have. And the temperature scale is measured in either degrees Celsius or degrees Kelvin. And we can use these physical properties to create scales on devices to help us measure how hot or cold something is. So first off, let's take a look at a thermometer. Now, a thermometer is used as a liquid in a very narrow tube. And that liquid, as you heat it up, will expand. Uh, if you cool it down, it will contract and fall back down. And so the physical property used here is thermal expansion. A thermistor, one of these things here, is an electronic component. And as you heat it up, some thermistors, their electrical resistance will decrease. It gets easier for a current to flow through the thermistor. And if you can measure that current, then you have a way of measuring temperature effectively. So the thermistor uses a physical property which changes as it gets hotter and cooler. And that physical property is called electrical resistance. Electrical resistance. How difficult or easy it is for an electrical current to flow through it. Finally, a clever little device called a thermocouple uses two metals and it, it creates a junction between those two metals. So one metal might be placed into a hot substance and the other metal probe might be into a cold or a cool substance. And the temperature difference between those two metals, two metal contacts, will create a small voltage. And that voltage will can be measured on a, a multimeter. So if you have a large temperature difference, then you'll register a large voltage. So this is a, a neat way of measuring temperature, especially for uh, situations where you need to uh, have a thermometer in a remote location. So the physical property that a thermocouple uses is temperature difference. Temperature difference between the two metal probes that it uses. So it's important that you appreciate that uh, many materials have physical properties that change with temperature. And we can use that to uh, help us measure temperature of materials.